Dr. Harding? Yeah? West Side speakers, please. Don't take this the wrong way, but isn't this kind of pointless? They're just going to be eaten anyway, right? Some will, yes. But others will adapt, find places to inhabit, mate, and carry on the species. A much better fate than being massacred in this pen. But they can't mate. Dad said the dinosaurs on the island are all girls. Well, you can never be 100% sure about something like that. Dr. Harding? Yeah? West Side speakers, please. So I heard you were like a hippie protester or something in the 70s. Where'd you hear that? From Yoder. The 70s were a tumultuous time. I fought for what I believed in, and sometimes it gets you arrested. You were arrested? And you still got a job as a, you know, scientist? Paleogeneticist. And yes, youth is the time to be reckless and test your boundaries. It's how you learn what's important to you. If we want to move the dinosaurs forward, we might need to give them a good scare from behind. Oh, we can use the danger call. Good thinking. Dr. Harding? Yeah? Activate the danger speakers. <laughs> Good job, Jess. Dr. Harding? Yeah? I need you to activate the east side speakers, please. East side, okay. to your assistant. Let's not talk about that right now. Well, did you work with him long? It doesn't matter. Oh. Listen, he was a wonderful young man. And I am sad. I really am. But if I let that stop my work, then all these animals will die too, trapped behind the walls that we built. You understand?
need a quick reminder about how the speakers work? Yes, please. These speakers on the west side of the pen can be set to play a parasaur food call that will attract the hungry dinos. The speakers on the east control the mating sounds that will attract the more, the uh, amorous dinosaur. The big speakers in the center emit a danger, danger call that will scare the dinos away from Dr. Harding? Yeah? Activate the danger speakers. Finally! Go forth and multiply. <laughs> You're pretty good at this. Maybe you'll be a behavioral scientist someday. Maybe I will. Ah, this is why she was elected to be the lookout. What's wrong with her foot? It's a broken toe. Feel free to have a look. I just have to do one more thing and then we can leave. Lysine. If the dinosaurs are a fighting chance, they'll need the solution to survive. I'm still not sure. Jerry, this is my life's work. These are basically my children. I'm not gonna let these creatures die because some bureaucrat can't stand losing control. They deserve their own lives. Just... Dr. Sorkin? Laura. Um, Laura, what's lysine? Ingen, Henry Wu, added a gene to the dinosaurs that makes them dependent on supplements of an amino acid called lysine. Without their weekly doses, they'll all die off. Don't tell my dad, but I got a D in chemistry. Then today should be very educational. The solution we were creating at the lab will reverse this scenario, allowing the animals to live out their natural lifespan. We just need to get it into the main water supply. Okay, that should be easy, right? This is a big responsibility, Jess. I can handle it, Dr. Sorkin. I mean, Laura. Okay, Jess, let's get started. 